back, everybody, to The Price is Right. Rich Fields, who you got next? I have Courtney Lyons. Come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. Courtney. Courtney, Courtney, Courtney. Come on down here, Courtney. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the show. Good luck. How about that? Good old Courtney. Uh, next prize, please. How about a pair of surfboards and bags? Original liquid shredder soft surfboards are made by surfers for surfers, developed and tested in the world-class surf of the Pacific Coast of Peru. Easy to ride, get high-performance surfboards for beginners and pros from Liquid Shredder. All right. Thank you, Manuela. Courtney, surfboards and bags, what do you bid? Um, uh, $1,000. $1,000. Yeah, what's that? Okay, $1,000. Bruce. $2,100. $2,100, says Bruce. Joshua. Eleven hundred. Eleven hundred dollars. I'm sorry. Nina. What's their bid? Uh, one thousand, twenty-one hundred, and eleven hundred. Um, fourteen hundred. Fourteen hundred dollars. Everybody went over. Everybody went over. Uh, lowest bid was thousand dollars. Go ahead and race them all, and uh, start again, Courtney. Lower than a thousand dollars. Okay. Four sixty-nine. Four hundred and sixty-nine dollars, Bruce. Eight fifty. Eight hundred and fifty dollars, uh, Joshua. Eight fifty one. Eight fifty one. Eight fifty two. Eight fifty two. <laughs> Joshua just got a contestant's row sandwich right there. How does it feel? Actual retail price: eight hundred and thirty eight dollars. Courtney, come on up here. Courtney. How are you feeling? Oh, so good. Yeah, good. Yeah. Oh, where are you from? I'm from Germantown, Maryland. Germantown, Maryland. Hey, everybody. Germantown, how you doing? But I go to Loyola Marymount University. Oh, okay. Hi, everybody from Loyola Marymount. There you go. Uh, what do we have for our uh, student here, Rich? Well, I think she could use this. It's a new hot tub. This beachcomber hot tub is a great place to connect with family and friends. Comfortable design, quality construction with a bamboo colored cabinet, and seating for five adults from beachcomber hot tubs. Thank you, Amber. She wants to know if she can have the bathing suit, too. Do you think we can throw in the bathing suit? Hmm. Yeah, we'll work on it. We'll work on it. Uh, I can't guarantee we'll throw in the bathing suit. But for the hot tub, uh, this game is called Bonkers. Okay, you're going to have only 30 seconds to complete this game. Okay. So it's a real fast-moving game. No slowing down. Uh, the, all these numbers are wrong. If you think the first number in the price of the hot tub is higher than a 4, you're going to put this paddle up here like this. If you think it's lower than a 4, put the paddle down there like that. You're going to do the same thing with all the other numbers. Okay. And then you're going to put them in there as fast as you can, yeah. and then run back here, hit this button. You hear that? You're wrong. You have to run back and change them all again as fast as you can. Come back here and hit the button. When you hear that, you can stop. Okay. But you only have 30 seconds, so it's, it's not about like, looking at the audience and asking them and stuff. It's moving as fast as you can. Okay, Courtney, you ready? 30 seconds. One, two, three, go! There she goes. Boom. Oh, she had the bottom one. No. Okay, go ahead. Keep going, keep going, keep going. Nice job, Courtney. 10 seconds have gone by. 15 seconds left, 15 seconds left, 11 seconds left, 6 seconds left, you got it, you got it, how about that, miracle finish, miracle finish, Courtney, way to go, Courtney's a winner, that was amazing, we got more pricey games coming up on the second half of the price is right, don't go away. That's right. Rich Fields has another name for us. Here it comes. I do. It's Patricia Sherman. Come on down. You're the next contestant on The Price is Right. All right. Patricia. Hop in like a bunny. Hi, Patricia. Welcome to the show. Welcome to the show. You made it. You made it. You made it. Uh, next prize, please. Here it is, Drew. It's a treadmill. This impressive treadmill provides a powerful workout for users at all fitness levels. You can even plug in a USB stick so you can work out to your favorite tune. All right, way to go, Amber. Amber's got places to go, things to do. Uh, Patricia, what do you bid for the treadmill? Fifteen hundred. 
hundred. Fifteen hundred dollars. Uh, Bruce. Sixteen fifty. Sixteen fifty. Joshua. Twenty three hundred. Twenty three hundred dollars. And uh, Nina. Twenty three oh one. Twenty three oh one. Oh man. Second time Joshua got a one. Actual retail price is two thousand four hundred ninety seven dollars. Nina, come on up here. Nina, come on up here. Thank you so much for wearing a Sounders shirt. I wore it because of you. Yeah, thank you. I, I own part of a soccer team in Seattle called the Seattle Sounders, so I love people that wear the Sounders shirt. Go Sounders. I'll tell you what. Uh, we were going to give you uh, a vacuum cleaner for a prize, but since you went more of the Sounders shirt, I just this second had him change everything around backstage, and here's what we have for you. Go ahead, Rich. Nina, it's this new car! It's a Ford Focus SE Coupe, comes standard with a 2.0 liter, 140 horsepower engine, an eco-friendly seating, plus cruise control, paint and fabric protection. It's the Ford Focus. Ford Focus. Uh, my apologies to the vacuum cleaner company, but we had to switch it up because she's wearing a Sounder shirt. Uh, now that car is on sale for 25 cents today. Isn't that amazing? And look what I have here, a card that says 25 cents on it. Okay. So congratulations, you have now have enough money to buy the car. Okay. But here's the trick. Uh, you have to give me all the numbers in the price of the car. Well, I'm going to give you the first one. The first number is a one, all right? You have to give me all the, all the rest of the numbers from those numbers up there, five, four, nine, eight, and six. Now, here's the trick. For every time, every number you're wrong, every time you're wrong, the price goes up by 25 cents. Okay. But every time you're right, you get to pick an envelope off the wall, and all those envelopes have more money in them. Okay. So at the end, you have to need more money than you need to buy the car. Uh, what's the next number in the price of the car? Six. No. And the price goes up to 50 cents. Uh, eight. Eight. Yes, eight. Go pick an envelope off the wall. Any envelope, any, any envelope off the wall at all, just bring it over to me. Crazy Rachel's car lot. 50 cents for a car. Pretty good price for a car. Uh, next number in the price of the car. Um, four. A uh, four. Nope. Crazy Rachel raised the price to 75 cents. Um, six. Six. Yes. Go to pick an envelope off the wall, any envelope, any envelope you want. Here you go. Five, four, or nine? Uh, nine. Nine. You got it. Any envelope you want off the wall, any envelope you want off the wall. Thank you very much. And finally, a five or a four? Um, five. Five. Now it's a dollar for the car. Uh, now uh, four, I think, is the last number. Okay, let's go yeah, with four. Let's go with four. I hate to ruin the suspense. Uh, any envelope you want off the wall, go ahead, grab any envelope you want. Oh, let me straighten this up. Here we go, let's see. Okay, here we go. Thank you. All right, four envelopes. $18,694 is the price of the car. It's a dollar, though, okay. for you. You have 25 cents. You need 75 cents to buy the car. Let's find out what you got. Let's start with this one right here. Nickel. 30 cents you're up to. Dime. Up to 40 cents. You need 60 cents to buy the car. <laughs> 25 cents. Let's look at the breakdown over there. 65, you need 35 cents at least. We have 350s, a 75, and a $2. So out of all those cars, we have 350s, a 75, and a $2. I got bad news. You're going to have to pay title and tax on a brand new car! Two dollars! Two dollars! First car she picked! First car she picked! Two dollars! Way to go, look at that! An $18,000 Ford Focus for Nina. We'll be right back with more prices right after this!
What's that? That's last night's dinner. Hate lingering odors? Febreze Air Effects.